Hi everyone, welcome to our channel BS Engineering. In this video, we will know about the importance of compaction in the field work. How far compaction is important in when you are doing a field work or when you are working on a site. So first of all, we will see what is compaction. Compaction. Compaction is the process of densification of soil by means of mechanical energy. It is the process of densification of soil by means of mechanical energy. So, when you are applying mechanical energy on a soil mass which was loosely packed earlier or which is loosely arranged earlier or a loose deposit, it results in the formation of a, a densely packed arrangement. Densely packed arrangement means closely packed arrangement. Closely packed arrangement uh, means uh, the void space. Uh, void space the space between the grain to grain this is the void space the space between the grain to grain is going to get minimized or reduced on doing compaction so that is why this compaction is very much important in the field work especially when you are doing filling works filling works in case of embankments or in case of roads or uh, highway works or in case of uh, uh, filling of uh, low lying areas or in case of uh, foundation on loose soils so in all these cases compaction is very much important in the field work what are the objectives of compaction let us see objectives of compaction what are the aims or objectives we are having behind doing this compaction work so firstly, in order to increase, increase the shear strength of the soil on doing compaction, shear strength of the soil is going to get increased, which leads to increase in bearing capacity of soil. This is very important. Bearing capacity of soil is going to increase with increase in shear strength. This shear strength is increased because of doing a compaction of the soil. That is the first step. Second one. Increase in density of soil mass increase in density of soil mass which is because of a reduction reduction of a pore spaces so here because of compaction reduction of pore spaces is going to take place Reduction is going to take place, pore spaces are going to get reduced, which in turn results in the increase in density of the soil. Soil density is going to be increased because of this compaction. And third one, to reduce the permeability of soil 
So when you are laying a, an embankment, uh, the permeability of soil is very much important. It should be able to, or in case of earthen dam, on the earthen dam what we are constructing, it should be able to resist flow of water. So permeability should be very low in that case. So when we are doing good compaction, if the compaction is very much or highly effective, it will definitely reduce the permeability of the soil. So that is another objective. And the fourth objective is to reduce settlements in soil under working loads. So the fourth objective is to reduction of settlement in the soil under working loads so that reduction in settlement is achieved by doing compaction. So why it is achieved means that when we are doing compaction after densification process has completed what is going to happen a densely packed arrangement is going to be attained by us. So on, on attaining a densely packed arrangement or closely packed arrangement uh, the susceptibility for change in volume is very very less. So we can expect very very less amount of uh, changes in the soil or change on volume of the soil that is why amount of settlement taking place also will be reduced because of this uh, uh, compaction process.